Hello, hello, hello. It is your friend, Terrible ASMR. Thank you once again for 1,000 subscribers. It's opening night in the NBA, all right? So I'm rocking the Celtics, all right? Opening night when I'm filming this. Let's get a recap going of week... Uh, it might be week six. It might be week six, NFL, baby. Let's get this review going. I prefer not to talk about this game, all right? You know what, I actually, the thing is, I, I saw the end of this game and that was it. <laughs> and I still hated the whole game. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I heard this was a rough one. <laughs> the Commanders and the Bears. <laughs> we don't need to say much about this one. 12-7. Uh, Bears lost. It just, uh, it's just a rough one. <laughs> it was a rough one, so if I picked a good game to miss... <laughs> That's all I can say. I picked a really good one to miss. Uh, but yeah, we don't need to talk about this one. <laughs> Up next, 49ers, Falcons. Falcons. Falcons came to play. Falcons came to play. They didn't come to pass. <laughs> I do have to say, um, I missed all of the first half of the 1 o'clock games. And then at the end of the... For the second half of them, uh, I... I mostly watched the Pats, and I did have Red Zone Channel on a little bit, but didn't see as much as I would have normally. So, this review is uh, as much for me as it is for the video, because <laughs> I gotta see what happened. But yeah, Falcons. Falcons came to play, man. Falcons came to play. 49ers did not. Jimmy G, two picks. He was not great, it looks like. Jeff Wilson, he didn't show up. I don't even know who these Falcons running backs are. Who are they? I don't know them. Caleb Hundley, Tyler Algier. I don't know them. They got a lot of carries though. I guess Patterson's injured. Ayuk had a nice... Uh, Ayuk was the only one who showed up. Kittle had a nice game too. Even Debo. Decent stats here, but Jesus. The, uh, the Falcons... Falcons... Falcons got the dub. A couple of turnovers. All right, no defensive touchdowns, so you're, you guys are good. You're good, but uh, Falcons 3-3 three and three now. 49ers 3-3. Three and three. I, I would have picked the 49ers in this one for sure. I would have definitely picked the 49ers, so would have taken the L here. We got the boys. Yeah, we got the Bats versus the Browns. You already know who I'm going to pick in this one. You already know who I would have picked in this one. I always pick the Bats. All right, I, I don't always, but you guys know. Anybody who's watching enough videos knows the Pats are the only team I get right. <laughs> uh, I picked, I've picked, i picked all of our losses this year. It's been pretty easy picks for the Pats. <laughs> uh, the wins and the losses. Um, I wouldn't have predicted uh, how badly we'd win these, but, uh, I mean, it was, it was close. It was close for a good amount. Uh, the Browns, they, they almost had the onside kick. Uh, that almost brought it back. It, it was close. Uh, they could have got the two-point. Browns read it uh, till the end of the fourth, you know. Uh, and then Pat just pulled away. Zappy, dude, 300 yards, two touchdowns. He's solid. He's solid. He's he's doing enough. <laughs> I mean, Brissett, Brissett had a dreadful game. No help from Chubb. Uh, and they just, they really didn't get much going. Uh, they really didn't. But uh, I like the Pats, man. The defense looks good. Kind of. Kind of. They're all right. They're all right. But, dude, yo, I got to talk about the rookie, Tyquan Thornton. He had a receiving touchdown and a rushing touchdown. Let's go. <laughs> That's the one bright spot we have. Ramondre Stevens, he had a great game, too. I mean, took over the backfield. Took over the backfield with, with Damian Harris out. So, I mean, good win for the Pats. This is a 1-3 and three team with two very solid wins. And... Browns got beat kind of bad. Uh, I mean, this was close. Once again, another close one. They just pulled away at the end. Browns, we already know. We already said, I say this every video, the Browns, ah, they should be better than what the record is. Uh, and they would be better if they had a real quarterback. Uh, Brissett's just not the guy. Two and four Browns. Honestly, Browns, don't worry about this year. <laughs> Get a draft pick. <laughs> but they got a good team. That's the thing. Uh, we'll just, we'll have to see. We'll have to see. But nice win for my boys.
Packers, Jets. Before this, they were both three and two. Who would have thought that the Jets would get the dub? No, I, I, I get it. I, the Jets, they're not terrible. <laughs> they're not terrible anymore. We have to we have to accept that they are not terrible. They're like the Giants, dude. They are no longer terrible. We don't really know if they're good yet. But they're no longer terrible. Okay, that's that's the current information that we are we have. All right. We do know that the Packers are no longer good. All right. They have some flaws. And Rodgers, I mean, he's getting old. I he's still good, but it, it, it reminds me of, I mean, it reminds me of the, the the later years with Brady. I mean, maybe even the last year, but we, did, we didn't really have a, we had a solid defense, uh, but we didn't really have, I don't know, I, I don't know what to think of the, the Packers team. They're just not good right now. They really aren't. Um, they're still 3-3, three and three, uh, but some of these games, it just, I don't know what. I don't know what Rodgers is doing here, man, but it's the Jets. It's the Jets. No, they're no longer bad. We have to accept that. The Jets, I mean, if they just got ah, Zach Wilson, I just don't believe in him at all. I don't believe in Zach Wilson at all. <laughs> uh, if they just, I don't know. They, they're 4-2, man. They're 4-2. Right behind the Bills, man. They're right there for that division. It's good stuff, man. Good stuff. Packers, 3-3. Three and three. They're still fine. But they're, they're not scary. They're not scary. Jaguars, Colts. All right. Colts got the dub. Ah, oh, man. It's hard to say. I feel like I, I would have made a dumb pick here, and I probably would have picked the Jags. <laughs> but, uh, dude, Matt Ryan, what the hell? <laughs> Turn back the clock, baby. Turn back the clock. 389. Three touchdowns. There you go, Matt. This is what I thought they would do. <laughs> they didn't even have Jonathan Taylor, man. Taylor didn't play. They didn't need him. They got Michael Pittman. <laughs> no, they, they just... Big, big game. Big passing game for them. Jeez. And none of them are big plays, too. I'm looking all at the longs. The longest is like 32 yards. It's just a good old-fashioned air raid, baby. And uh, another tough one for the Jags. Um... They're no longer bad, but they aren't good. They aren't good. Um, they, they could be bad. They could be bad. We don't know yet, all right? I, I don't have this information. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but uh, we'll see. We will see. Nice win for the Colts. 3-2-1. and 3-2-1. Nice record. Nice record. Vikings. Dolphins. I mean, you could have seen this coming. Vikings, 24-16, they get the dub. The Dolphins, man. Bridgewater, he, he's not the guy. He ain't the guy. You need Tua. You need Tua. Maybe if you have Tua, you win this game. They still got a lot out of Bridgewater, but they, they got too much, all right? Two picks. Two picks, it looks like. Two picks. Waddle fumbled. Interesting. <laughs> but, uh... Good win for the Vikings. Uh, Dolphins are a good team. Good defense. A lot of weapons on offense. And uh, they didn't. I mean, Tyreek Hill went off. Jalen Waddle went off. And then he got Kiseki with two touchdowns. And they still won. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. A lot of yards uh, for such a low amount of points. That's crazy because... Yeah, because this, this game was... I, I, I wonder how many of those yards just came in the second half because I remember early on it was uh, in the third quarter. It was just like... It was just 10-3. Yeah, okay, so it was 10-3. And I was like, all right, well, come on, Vikings. Like, pick it up. And then they just pulled away. And then I guess the Dolphins got a couple more. Got their two touchdowns um, late in the fourth or whatever. But they, uh, they probably racked up a bunch of yards just trying to come back in the game. I don't know. I, I did not. Like I said, I, did, I missed I missed a lot of football this weekend. All right, I was busy. A little busy. Uh, just just at that time. But <laughs> good game for the Vikings. Five and one. I mean, uh, I picked them missing the playoffs. And it's going to come back to bite me, uh, possibly, because they're a solid squad. And 
five and one start, it's gonna be really hard for them to to mess this up. <laughs> up next, Bengals, Saints. Would have picked the Bengals in this one for sure. I do not believe in the Saints at all. Especially with Andy Dalton. I mean he's okay, but he's okay. <laughs> Joe Burrow, great day for him. Three hundred and three touchdowns. Mixon, not much out of him. Actually, I know, I know Mixon uh, didn't do shit. I have him in one of my leagues. <laughs> but uh, Kamara, one yard away from 100. That's a shame. Big game from Chase. Big game from Chase. Boyd Higgins doing enough. Good game for the Bengals. Um, hey, 30 to 26. Could have went either way. Bengals. Bengals won by one by four. They got nine in the fourth. They were losing going into the fourth. That's a good win. That's a good win. This is a Bengals team that was, uh, they were 0-2, or they won in 3 for a bit. I don't know if they've won 2 straight now, but they're 3-3. Three and They've steadied the tide, um, and Burrow's looking fine. Uh, I just, they gotta protect him, man. Three sacks, alright. I mean, I've seen worse uh, from the Bengals, but three sacks, I guess they'll take that. <laughs> Ravens. Giants. Giants got the dub, man. Five and one for the Giants. Like I said earlier, we know they aren't bad. We just don't know if they're good yet or not. And they are sure off to a good start. I mean, five and one. Five and one. New head coach. New head coach. Barkley's healthy. Danny Dimes. He's okay. <laughs> He's okay. <laughs> uh, they just, they got a good squad. They really do. Um, good game from Mark Andrews. Kenyon Drake went over 100 yards. Good for him. <laughs> Lamar was all right. Uh, just, um, it's, uh, what was it, uh, first first three games, Lamar's playing like a sure MVP, and then last couple, he's just, he's calmed down a little bit, but tough loss for them. I would have picked the Ravens to win this, too. I would have definitely picked them, but Giants got the win. 5-1, and one, Ravens 3-3, three and 24-20. Three, nice victory. Nice victory. I'll give it to them. Up next, Steelers, Buccaneers. Last of the 1 o'clock games here. The Steelers got the win, dude. 20-18. to 18. Brady sucks this year, man. Brady's not good. I don't know if it's Brady, but I, uh, I, I, I didn't see anything from this game. I saw nothing. Um, but dang. He's got Godwin back. He's got Godwin. He's got Evans. They got the guys, man. They got the guys. This is on Brady. No, I don't know. The Steelers, come on. Come on, you gotta beat a Steelers team. You cannot lose to a crappy Steelers team that they have this year. You can't do it. You can't do that. And they did. But let's see. Uh, Najee, he didn't, Najee didn't even do anything. <laughs> Claypool, 96 and a touchdown. That's pretty good. But, jeez. I'm shocked. I'm shocked. No, this is, no, I'm not shocked. I mean, this, this is the NFL. This is why we watch because anybody can win. Anybody can win. Except in the playoffs. <laughs> Except in the playoffs. <laughs> nice win for the Steelers. Two and four. Not sure it helps them. You want draft picks? <laughs> get Kenny Pickett some help. <laughs> Give, get Trubisky some help. <laughs> All right, into the four o'clock games. We have Rams, Panthers. P.J. Walker was in for the Panthers today, and he led them to victory. He didn't. He did not lead into victory. They got 10 points. Rams won 24-10, and thank God they're playing the Panthers, man, because they're 2-3. and three. They're 2-3. and three. They need an easy win. They needed a good win. Uh, Panthers, there's rumors that they're trying to maybe move McCaffrey, but who's, who's going to really make that trade? They, they, they want a first-round pick, or I don't know. That's what they say. Um, why, why would you use a first-rounder or even a second-round pick? on McCaffrey and aging McCaffrey on his contract when you could look in the draft and probably, obviously you're not going to be able to draft McCaffrey, but you can draft pretty good running back production uh, from the draft first uh, and second round, really. I mean, just look at Brees Hall. Brees Hall was a second rounder, I believe. Uh, you don't need to trade first and second round picks for an aging, injury prone running back. Uh, you can just get a young one, a fresh one from the draft. <laughs> so I don't think the Panthers are going to move them. Maybe that rumor is just, it's just 
maybe it's just one of those things where it's like, uh, oh, teams are offering, and the Panthers are like, yeah, 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 give me a, give me a billion dollars, give me a billion dollars, I'll trade you, we'll trade you, McCaffrey. They're just not gonna budge. Uh, they probably don't truly want to trade him. I don't even know how many years are on his deal. Uh, I got no clue. I actually have no idea. But Cooper Cup, seven catches, eighty yards. Slow day for him. Slow day. Allen Robinson finally showed up though, so Rams have to be happy about that. It's not over for them, uh, but they still they got some they got some shit to figure out. Seahawks, Cardinals. This is interesting. I don't know who I would have picked. I like the little run the Seahawks got going, and I don't believe in the Cardinals at all. Uh, but I, I feel like I would have been compelled to just pick the Cardinals anyways. Um, but, hey, Seahawks. Seahawks got them. I, I would have picked the Seahawks. I would have picked them. Uh, Geno Smith, baby. <laughs> Kenneth Walker, first game starting. I don't know if he started before. Uh, I thought it was always Penny. And now Penny's out. Um, and Walker. Walker's the main guy. I don't know if that was... I don't know if they, they were just splitting before. Walker wasn't really doing it. I don't know, but good game from him, man. Good game. No fan. Look at no fan showing up. Didn't do much. Six catches, 45. That's all right. He was the best one. <laughs> best. He had the best uh, receiving stats. Um, sloppy game offensively uh, for the Seahawks, but they got it done. They got it done. They got it. Nice win for the Seahawks. They're three and three. Cardinals, two and four. Up next, last of the four o'clock games. Bills Chiefs. Good one from the Bills. Uh, I, I think I would have picked the Bills. I easy to say after the fact. I mean, these are both two really good teams. You, you can't go wrong with either pick. Uh, but I think I would have just went with the Bills. Uh, if they meet again in the playoffs, I feel like the Chiefs take that every time. I don't know. The Bills are good, though, man. The Bills are really good. Uh, it'll be interesting. I really hope they AFC Championship game right here. Really hope this is it. Uh, five and one Bills, four and two Chiefs. Get them, get them that one and two seed. You know, I would love that. I think I think that's great. Uh, but Mahomes, decent day from him. He could have been better. Josh Allen just, uh, hey, end of the day. Josh Allen, no turnovers. Mahomes, two picks, you know. Is that the difference? We don't know. <laughs> but uh, good game for the Bills. Uh, dude, what was it? Uh, Tony Romo, <laughs> before the game, he's like, feels low scoring, 24-20. And then it's the exact score. So stupid. It's so stupid. <laughs> but good game for Juju. Good game for Kelsey. Hardman had a touchdown. Couldn't ask for much more, but you got you got Diggs, Davis, Knox, all getting into the end zone. So great effort, great effort from the Bills. They're five and one. Chiefs are four and two. Up next, Cowboys, Eagles. Little divisional matchup on Sunday night. I like it. I would have picked the Eagles. I'm, I I will pick the Eagles every week until they lose. Pretty much. That's how this works. <laughs> Good game from the Cowboys at this point. I mean, Rush, he, he was bad. He was pretty bad. Uh, they need Dak. They do need Dak. Rush, he's going to help you beat the bad teams. Not the good ones. All right, not the good ones. <laughs> it's not going to help you there. But they had a shot. It was a close one. Um, they're still 4-2. They're still solid. And they need Dak back. I forget if... Uh, I still don't know how soon he's coming back. It's. I feel like it's supposed to be soon now. Uh, but Jalen Hurts, solid game from him. Miles Sanders got in. Elliott got in. AJ, Devontae, all got touchdowns. So, good effort. Solid effort uh, from the Eagles. Both two good teams. I expect both of them in the playoffs. I think I picked them both to get in. I'm pretty sure I picked them both to get in. Into the playoffs. Not that it matters. Chargers, Broncos, this game, this game, while I was watching, I, I really wasn't thinking about it too much, but God, this game screwed me in fantasy. 
Uh, so, I, in, my, in our two, in the two ASMR leagues that we have, I have Justin Herbert. Uh, I'm okay with that. Uh, he's good, but all I needed from him was like 15 points in both leagues. In both leagues, all I needed was like 15 points. He ended with six. He had six points. I lost. I lost. To make it worse, the one league, I had Mike Williams. He had two catches for 17 yards. I just needed a, a little bit. I just needed below average games from them. All right, and I would have won. I didn't need this far below average. <sighs> and that that's a loss. That's a loss. Oh, man. It was tough. Eckler, I mean, he, he could have done better. He didn't even have a big game either. But still had two touchdowns. Anyways. Or not just one. Just one. Uh, but, ugh. I hate watching the Broncos play. Anytime the Broncos have to play, I hate it. I just hate it. But that's it. 1916 Chargers got the win in overtime. That's it. Uh, I think now we got to take a look at these standings. We can start looking at the playoffs here uh, just for fun. Uh, top seven teams, Bills, Chiefs, Titans, Ravens, Chargers, Jets, Colts, Bengals, Dolphins, Pats. They're all chilling at three and three waiting to get in. We head on down to the NFC. Eagles, Vikings, Bucks, 49ers, Giants all 5-1. and one. That's got to suck. And then the 4-2 and two Cowboys right behind them. I can't believe that division ended up being this good. That's crazy. It's, just, it's nuts. Rams at that 7th spot. Packers are out. Falcons, Seahawks all chilling at 3-3, three and three, so... That's week six, baby. That's week six.